If you are not cautious, scorching temperatures this week can be incredibly dangerous. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Olivia Schuler is live from Hartford Hospital this morning with how they're preparing to treat patients that are suffering from heat-related illness. Kaylin and Nicole, Dr. Cynthia Price here at Hartford Hospital says when a heat wave arrives, they make sure that they have everything that they need to treat patients with heat related illnesses. However, we want you to do everything you can to avoid a stay at the hospital. So here are some quick tips for you to avoid that hospital stay. Even at this early hour, start drinking water now. Get hydrated. When you're outdoors, stay in the shade and wear light, breathable clothing. And if you follow these steps and start to not feel well, be on the lookout for feeling hot, dizzy, nauseous, or vomiting. Dr. Price says children and older adults are at a higher risk of heat-related illness, so be mindful of those symptoms for yourself and others. Once you get to the point where you stop sweating and your consciousness is altered, meaning you're kind of going out and you're not just coming back like a quick faint, those are people that need to be in the hospital. Now, if worst comes to worst and you are experiencing any of those symptoms, Hartford Hospital is just a phone call away. They do have cooling baths ready to go and available for people that need them. But of course, if you're feeling any of those symptoms, immediately call 911. Make sure you check on your neighbors. And some of those symptoms also apply to your furry friends at home. We're live this morning in Hartford, Olivia Schuler, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. And as the